reclaiming Jen. If this is your first time to my channel, on my channel I talk about online teaching and how to start teaching from home if you are not already teaching online. I began this journey about two years ago and I used to be a substitute teacher in a brick and mortar school in my local public school board. And since then, I have begun to teach online only and I help others by coaching them to get hired with two of the companies I work for, GoGo -Go Kid and VIP Kid. And I also give advice on how to start teaching from home. There are many different companies that you can work for and teach from home. And not only just teaching online English, but I know many of you have probably heard about OutSchool by now. And I'm actually, I am hired to teach with OutSchool and I can help you with OutSchool too, but I have not taught yet for OutSchool. So I recently had a new discovery that will help me get started with OutSchool. And I'm really excited to share more about what I've found. So in the meantime though, today's video is about companies that you can work for if you are a non-native speaker. Throughout the two years that I have been teaching online, I have helped dozens of people start teaching with VIP Kid and GoGo Kid and even some people without school. And I have seen so many wonderful, excellent, top quality, highly educated teachers that don't end up getting hired because VIP Kid and GoGo -Go Kid hire native English speakers from North America. They have a neutral North American accent. And so it's really always such a difficult time for me when those people that have wanted to try and get hired with a VIP Kid don't have a neutral enough North American accent, they don't end up getting hired. And so I always wanna share with them some other opportunities that are available for people to teach English or anything they want online. So today I'm sharing those opportunities here with you. And I'm doing it in a bit of partnership with another teacher. We were in the same cohort for Nancy Taylor's Beyond Teaching ESL online course, which is now called Beyond Teaching Online. And uh, her name is Leah Sparrow. And she can be found at www.teacherleah.com. And I recently revisited her YouTube channel and her website. And wow, it's been just over a year and almost a year and a half that we participated in this course. And I'm just so proud of Leah and her accomplishments and um, just to see the evolution of her brand come to life. Um, actually, I'm a little bit jealous because I'm still working on my personal branding and where I want my online teaching business to go. I'm still um, in a growth um, pattern there. So check out Leah's website and her YouTube channel because man, she has a lot of solid information to share. And um, that little secret I was telling you about, about out school and how I think it's going to help propel me to actually create classes and open classes on out school, I found out from Leah's website. So, you need to go over there to Leah, teacherleah.com. Now, before we jump into non-native speaking teachers and the companies that they can apply for, I want to just mention some key companies or popular companies or maybe companies you've never heard of that native speakers of English in North America can teach for. These are the two companies that I'm currently in contract with. I teach mainly for VIP Kid, and I recruit or coach for both companies. Q Kids is another one that Leah teaches with, and what I understand is that they are Q Kids is small classes, so they're not one-on-one -on -one classes. But I haven't heard a bad thing about Q Kids, so that's something you should look into. And I am. Linking, of course, Leah's website here. And if you click on Leah's website, you are going to find this amazing guide that I have here. And it has all the details about these companies, um, the pay that you can expect, the requirements that you need for these companies, and um, 
any important details like do you need a TESOL or TEFL certificate? Is there a minimum classes required for this company? Because sometimes you have to teach a minimum of maybe uh, two hours a week. Um, so that's something that you need to look into. And that information is here. And she also provides um, people that can help you get hired. So other referral coaches that can help you get hired with these companies. And she lists that information on this document. Like I said before, Leah has a plethora of really useful information and she's giving it to you for free. So I chatted with Leah and made sure that it was okay for me to share this information and uh, to kind of collaborate on this video where I can send people to her website and her YouTube channel um, where they can learn more information. So it's pretty cool. I'm happy to have some colleagues that are willing to collaborate. So again, and these are for native speakers, VIP Kid, Q Kids, Go Go Kid, Wales English is another one, Zebra English. I'm hearing a lot about Zebra English and Magic Ears. Magic Ears is getting a lot of attention, a lot of buzz lately. Um, a lot of people are enjoying Magic Ears in that it is small group classes. The classes are very energetic. The teachers need to be energetic. And for your feedback, you get to record it, uh, voice, voice record your feedback. So you don't need to type anything out. It's just a short 30 second voice recording of your feedback to each student in the class. So that's kind of cool and different. And two other ones that she lists here are iTutor Group and Say ABC. Um, teacher Kia. Guys, it's Teacher Kaya. I'm sorry. Kaya, you are rocking your YouTube channel. So I'm giving you this great shout out since I messed up your name. I'm so sorry. Has a video about her journey so far with Education First. And I actually just recently heard about English First. I haven't even had a chance to click on anything to find out about English First. But I thought that was interesting to have two companies that are similarly named. So again, Teacher Kia. Kaya, it's Kaya, Jen, Kaya. It has a lot of information about group, um, companies like this too. Guys, the possibilities are endless with online teaching. Yesterday, I was um, doing a little prep work for these videos and I was like, it'd be fun to teach math. Like I really like math, math is my strong suit um, when I'm teaching in the brick and mortar. And I thought, wow, well, I wanna teach math classes. And I just dug around a little bit and found, um, I'd already heard about Splash Learn, but I didn't know a lot about it. So that's a possibility of teaching with Splash Learn. Um, it does say that Splash Learn only hires American teachers, but um, the person I have for a referral, she actually emailed them to ask if I, as a Canadian, could apply. And she said they're on a hiring freeze right now, but they said they would hire a Canadian. So that's pretty cool. Um, another um, company was... Prodigy. Now, I don't know if you are familiar with Prodigy, but it's a math game. A lot of schools will subscribe to Prodigy and classes will play this math game. It's related to the curriculum and I played around with it yesterday to find that not only is it Ontario curriculum, um, they have like Common Core for each state, like they can tweak it to where you live. So that's pretty awesome. And so they've introduced um, online classes to go along with the the program that your student might be working on at school or I know that it's uh, available for homeschooling families too so I'm gonna check that out my kids have never played I didn't even know this because I guess it's only some schools that I've um, encountered that subscribe to Prodigy and both of my kids have never played it, which is surprising um, because they're, you know, heading into grade six and grade eight. So um, I'm looking forward to getting them an account and checking that out, especially since things are winding down here with homeschool. There's not a lot of motivation. Uh, the weather's great. The kids want to play with their friends. Um, so there's not a lot of uh, formal homeschooling going on last month or this month. Guys, if you don't know, you're new to my channel, this is our first year homeschooling due to coronavirus and uh, it has been quite the learning curve to go from momming to momming and teaching um, and staying home all the time and not having their sports and stuff. It has been a journey, let me tell you. <laughs> 
chime in below or DM me on Instagram or send me an email if you are in a similar situation because now we've got next year looming too and I'm like another year of homeschool <laughs> anyway I just want to pop that in okay so those are some ideas for native speakers and I mentioned as well some math places oh the other one I wanted to mention was is called Luna Lab and uh, it's Canadian it has an Ontario curriculum uh, it's based in Toronto and I, I just recently reached out to them for the purpose of um, supplementing a homeschool and as well to see what it would be like to teach for them okay the information that you came for into this video is for non-native speakers okay maybe you are a non-native speaker you've tried to get hired with the VIP kid and GoGo -Go kid and Q kids and Zebra English and you're not having much much success um, here are some other options for you and I always always tell my referrals about out school guys you can teach anything on out school um, I always plug out school because I do think it is the coolest thing where you don't need a degree nobody cares about how much schooling you've had um, all you need is to learn how to use zoom through their platform obviously and of course you need to pass the hiring process but you can teach anything you're passionate about and um, some people teach baking which is so cool crafts making slime a chit chat group fitness classes and stretching for gymnasts and and uh, dance and that sort of thing they lead dance classes um, woodworking sewing like all kinds of things and then of course like the common education courses if you need a tutor you can do that you can teach anything you have passion for and that is approved by out school so not only do you not need a degree you don't need to be a native speaker and you can be hired in so many countries too you have to live in the US the UK Canada Australia or New Zealand guys it's so cool <laughs> I can't wait to get started on out school guys the thing that I'm not why I'm not teaching there yet is because I don't want to plan I've been a substitute teacher for 18 years and there's a reason for that I don't want to plan lessons I don't want to plan a gym class I don't want to plan science I don't I love teaching other people's plans and um, I think maybe I found an answer to my woes for out school I'm really excited about this possibility non-native speakers I know you're waiting oh my gosh here we go you've probably sped through all this rigmarole and you're here now non-native speakers the most popular one that you've probably heard of is pal fish pal fish is another ESL company based out of China you're teaching Chinese students and most people know Palfish because they don't require a degree so if you don't have a degree I always say Palfish and OutSchool those are my two go-to's when I'm recommending but here's some more okay so for Palfish non-native speaker you can actually be from the US UK Canada Australia New Zealand Ireland South Africa another one is called fluentb.com fluentb.com and so it says here that they don't specifically mention that they recruit non-natives but there must be some uh, information or people that are hired that work from there that have an accent that is not native North American another one is italki and I'm hearing more about this company where you can set your own rate and I'm pretty sure you can teach languages other than English so italki we want to check out that one if you are a non-native North American English speaker um, another one here is called Engu or Ingu or Engu <laughs> Engo E-N-G-O-O -O. Uh, I've never heard of this one before but you need to be at least 18 years old you need to be proficient in English because you will take an English test and uh, you can work from home teaching English learn light is another one all of this information again is on teacher Leah's website you just have to submit your email address and she will send you all this amazing information on this guide that she provides she must have done so much work compiling all this information it's awesome so learn light is another one preply is another one preply is like a marketplace like out school I do believe you can teach adults and children um, so check out preply.com preply.com 
slash en slash teach. iTutor Group also hires non-native North American speakers. So check that out. And those ones I talked about, um, it could be as low as $10 an hour, up to $10 an hour, to $22 an hour, and learn light and properly you set your own rates. And iTutor Group says up to $37 an hour. Wow. Anyway, um, that is some information for non-native speakers. And the last thing I want to talk about in this video is, of course, people that don't have a bachelor's degree. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Next week's video will be the companies that will hire you if you don't have a bachelor's degree. So subscribe, click the notification bell and all notifications, and you will know when that video pops up next week. In the meantime, check out my cool class and check out Hallo, H-A-L-L-O. They are a company that is hiring teachers to teach adults and they are looking for teachers that want to recruit as well. So you can email my friend Jamie Macon at teacher at H-A-L-L-O dot TV.